let's try this question okay for this one they give uh, a value for a and a value for b then they ask us to calculate the pressure for the potential for b and water potential for a okay by using this formula we can get the answer solid potential for a is negative 250 kilopascal okay and pressure potential for a as it was not a um, plant cell and there's no stopper so automatically the value for the pressure potential is zero kilopascal so that we can find 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 the water potential so the water potential is negative 250 kilopascal for b pressure potential equal to solid potential minus water potential so pressure potential is negative sorry positive 800 180 1, kilopascal okay so as the pressure potential must be always in positive value so now we get the answer for a for b show the directions of water in this tube water potential we move from high water potential towards low water potential as we can see here water potential for b is negative 120 kilopascal and water potential for a is negative 250 kilopascal so that water will move from high water potential towards low water potential high water potentials toward low water potential why does this value is high water potential because the number is less negative comparing to the a so water will move from B to A. This involving a plant cell. So plant cell do have the pressure potential and the pressure potential is always in positive value. For the solution, we do not have cell wall. It do not have cell wall and it do not have any stopper. So automatically, the pressure potential for the solution is 0 kilopascal. So now calculate the water potential for the cell and for the solution. Automatically, we can calculate the water potential for both. So water potential uh, for cell and solution, we can use the formula of water potential equal to solid potential plus pressure potential. So, water potential for this one is negative 100 kilopascal water potential for the cell. And water potential for the solution is negative 300 kilopascal. So, we can answer this but you must use the formula at the above show the directions of the water water move from high water potentials to low water potential as we can see here water potential for the cell is higher comparing to the water potential of the cell as the water potential in the cell is less negative comparing to the water potential of the um, solution so the directions of water is water will move out from the cell towards the solution. Describe what happened to the cell after it's immersed in the solution. So the cell will become plasmolyzed. So for this one, please refer to the uh, notes before this. Please take note that you have to show the formula with the complete calculation during your calculation to get the any uh, water potential or solid potential or pressure potential.